Today is the Texas versus OU. Feeling so overwhelmed. People are literally already lined up. Dressing up for game days and stuff like that. That is the feeling that I'm getting right now. So I'm like a little bit shaken up, I'm not gonna lie. Look at all the freaking people that are already lined up. I'm just not getting off, it's literally 12.40. Today is the Texas versus OU game, so it's gonna be super busy at work. So I'm really excited for that, but I need to start getting ready, so let's go. One of the first things that I like to do in the morning after I stretch, because y'all, I be so tired, is brush my teeth. And recently I've been using the Smile Y10 Pro, which let me put y'all on because honestly, I'm not a huge fan of gimmicky stuff, but this is something I will add to my daily routine. A few cool features that the toothbrush has is a U-Smile brush head, smart screen, power button, mode button, as well as a pressure indicator. It has a 24-7 smart screen that includes an oral map, plaque reminder, as well as a two-minute timer. It has responsive brushing and it also has a six-month runtime, so the battery on this thing is insane. The toothbrush itself has first tier bristles, smart gum care, and four cleaning modes. And those cleaning modes are smart mode, clean mode, white mode, and soft mode. But what's so neat about this toothbrush is that it allows you to do the bass method without having to actually learn what that method even is. And when I was trying to research it, it was a little bit confusing, but here's the short version of it. It's basically a method of brushing your teeth that is effective for removing plaque recommended by the American Dental Association. So this toothbrush basically does all of that for you without you having to do the extra little intermission because I totally forgot to share some of my favorite features about the Y10 U Smile Pro. So I wanted to pop on real quick and tell y'all a little bit more about this super cool toothbrush and just how it can benefit you guys because I know y'all don't want me just on here selling y'all gimmicky stuff and this is definitely not one of those things. I actually thoroughly enjoy this toothbrush. Overall, I just feel like I'm getting such a better clean on my teeth when using this toothbrush that I don't get when using regular toothbrushes. The vibration from this toothbrush helps so much with the plaque on my teeth and that is one of the things I absolutely hate about teeth like plaque just disgusts me so much so this helps a ton with removing any like built-up plaque throughout the day but I wanted to show you all a little bit about what comes in the box so this is what the box looks like whenever you'll get it and when you open it this is just what everything looks like so you're gonna have your little manual to figure out how to work it and then you'll get your little charger cord you'll also get two brush heads this is for my first one, it just fell out. But you'll get two brush heads, so these are what they look like before you open them up. And they're really simple to put on there. All you have to do is just pop it on and then it's on there and it's good. However, one of my favorite features is the oral map and the plaque reminder that you get whenever you're done brushing your teeth. Just because sometimes we're just brushing our teeth and we're not actually really doing as good of a job as we think we're doing. So this brush, the smart technology, it tells you like, hey, you need to brush a little bit longer in this area or this area. So that's really, really nice whenever I'm missing certain areas and I wanna make sure my mouth is clean. But yeah, if oral hygiene is super important to you, which it should be super important to you, if not, that's a little concerning. But oral hygiene is super important to me, so I have loved adding this into my routine. And if any of y'all are just like me and oral hygiene is super important to you as well, then definitely look into the Y10 Pro. I really don't think you guys will be disappointed, but it's up to you to try it out and see for yourself. So I have my code listed in the description box down below if you guys would like to try it, but it's just SYW10 Pro. But yeah, you guys, I just want to come in and tell y'all a little bit more about this toothbrush because it really is that good, and I just don't want you to think that... I'm just over here just trying to sell you something because at the end of the day the toothbrush is really good and it has tremendously helped my oral hygiene so i just thought i'd put you guys on good mother trucking morning you guys i'm in such a better headspace now because i'm finally like up and actually getting ready i wash my face and brush my teeth and now we're gonna actually get ready i need to move y'all up a little bit because i'm kind of cut off we're getting ready today because we have work at 10 30 it's about to be eight so i have the most time that i've had at all this week I'm actually on like a six day stretch So I work six days straight But I was running late to work yesterday Like I didn't get there until 10.40 And I had to be there at 10.30 So that was not good I was freaking out because I ended up sitting at Dwayne's house And me, him, and Isabel We all like had dinner together It was actually so pure and so much fun Like I had such a good time And it was exactly what I needed that day Because I just was feeling so overwhelmed
filmed and just so just in my head about everything i mean for valid reasons for valid reasons i don't want to invalidate myself but i just was feeling very hurt so i ended up going to the wayne's house and we all just hung out and it was so much fun we ended up staying up to like three four in the morning watching the kardashians so yeah i didn't wake up until 10 12 and i was all the way in dallas and where my job is compared to dallas that's like a good 30 minute drive whereas like my house to my job is like 10 to 15 minutes so it just was not a good situation for me but i made it to work i got ready and the day was fun ended up being hostess so i didn't make really any money besides like what i got hourly that day but hopefully today will be a much better day i woke up so i'll be there early and on time and also we have the texas ou game which is like the hugest freaking rivalry in like college football in texas and when i tell you people are literally already lined up at the cotton bowl right now waiting to get in it's crazy it's just gonna be a huge huge day i'm gonna be on the floor i've sold two calendars i've sold a mini i've sold merchandise i've actually sold i think like two things of merchandise i'm not sure don't hold me on that but i've sold my stuff so i should get a section today really excited for that i'm gonna try to sell some more calendars today my family's coming in so i'm gonna be selling some calendars to them my dad's a huge texas fan so he is like super hype about this game also hold on let me show you what i made last night because it's so cute I made this little halter top shirt for the BOU game and this is like the current game. I just bought this at Dick's. It was literally a $30 shirt y'all but I needed it for work so I cut it up and I'm gonna be wearing it like even when it's not this game like I'm gonna wear it just to support Texas. Yeah I made that. I actually posted a like DIY video on my Patreon just for like fun and giggle. So yes so about Patreon. I actually stopped posting on Patreon for a while and then it accident not accidentally I guess I just like I didn't the hold went off or something you know it ended up like charging everybody that was on my patreon so now i'm posting on patreon again to try to like make up for that charge basically so i'm gonna be posting a little bit extra so if y'all want to join that the link is in my description box down below but i don't know how long i'm gonna keep this up for if i i'm gonna just give it like this month and you know test it out wiggle with it play with it while i'm like working and doing content creation full-time as well because before i started working at hooters i kind of stopped my patreon so i haven't really done it since working at hooters now that i do have two jobs i want to see how well i can handle posting on patreon as well so yeah but always have your tumbler drink your water part of the stanley crew now can we talk about it my stanley is the best stanley i love it so much girl was not gonna buy a stanley cup because them hoes are expensive so when i got a free stanley cup i was like thank god now i'm obsessed like i love my stanley oh my god it's gonna be a great day it's gonna be a great day recently every single time i put in my contacts they freaking send my eyes into a rage like my eyes are just immediately on fire and like so red so puffy and a lot of y'all were saying it's because of my skincare which today i did obviously use skincare but the other day i was putting in my contacts and i had no like no skincare on like my face was freshly washed like i had just washed my hands literally had no skincare on my hands and my eyes were on fire y'all like so freaking bad so it's not necessarily my skincare i'm gonna do my makeup this is gonna be a daily vlog so i'm gonna try to not just sit here and talk y'all's ear off because i will <laughs> i will talk your ear off yeah i'm gonna just beat up do my makeup do my hair get ready for work i'm super excited to show oh my god i need to shave my armpits i totally forgot about that yeah i'm wearing a halter shop today so i'm gonna have to figure out the armpit situation <laughs> Six on me retarded, supercharged in this bitch That little boy, I stick that rod in this bitch
ready. I am all dressed and ready to go. I have my BOU shirt that I made into a halter top yesterday. I already have my little name tag and everything. This is what it looks like in the back. I am just a little concerned because I do have a little bit of side boob. But other than that, like I'm pretty much ready to go. I'll just real quickly give y'all like this overview. So this is kind of what the outfit's looking like right now. I'm super excited. I feel super festive and like I love dressing up like this. Like this just takes me back to like when I was in cheer in high school and like dressing up for game days and stuff like that. That is the feeling that I'm getting right now and I am obsessed. Like I'm so excited to go today and I just feel like this makes me actually like, want to work because I'm like ah. I feel all festive and stuff. I'm about to head out because I gotta go. It's already like 9.30 and you get there at 10.30 like I said. So we're about to leave right now. I just got to work and y'all I almost lost my life like two times this freaking morning driving here so I'm like a little bit shaken up and not gonna lie like my stomach hurts so bad right now like I just have a lot of anxiety just because of literally almost losing my fucking life on the way here but I made it we're safe and sound it's 9 51 and yeah Julia is actually the first one here her car is in the parking lot but I don't think any of the other girls are here yet so I think it's just me and her here but yeah we're about to go in and get our morning shifts done so we can start the day Oh, Ooh. Jesus. Sean, you scared no, the this shit out of me. Fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Currently 10.06, it's only me, Julia, and Jada here so far. I can't feel like actually like all the way ready today, so I'm doing Gucci in a Gucci, but I put my lip gloss on. I might get questions about my lip combo that I'm wearing today, so I'm wearing the Hard Candy Perfect Match Lip Liner, and then I'm wearing the Buxom Lip Plumping Gloss in the Camila shade, so... Yeah, and then my lashes are linked on my LTK. These I got from Amazon. Shirt I got from Dick Sporting Goods. And then the rest of it is Hooters. But waiting right now, Sean actually ended up getting all of us Starbucks. So super excited for that. I got a little strawberry acai refresher. That is gonna be like just a great little treat to my day. Hey guys, look at all the freaking people that are already lined up. It's gonna be a really busy day. It's about 11. Oh, I haven't even clocked in. Look, there's the Hooters calendar girl working the bar. Her name is Julio. Where'd she go? Come to Hooters and Garland and get your signed calendar from the calendar girl Julio. Here's the calendar girl sister, Sadway, working the cash machine over there. Y'all, I'm just not getting off. It's literally 12.40. I have to be back up here at 10. Ugh, you guys. Doubles are not my day. Doubles are not my day. However, I did make some good ass money. So I'll insert how much I made right now. Let's see how much I made after working a double for the Texas OU game at Hooters. I worked 16 hours today, you guys. 16 hours. My feet are screaming. But hopefully the money was worth it. So let's see how much I make sure I grab everything. Let's see how much I made. Did make sixty dollars on Zelle, sixty dollars on Venmo, and then girl whose night shift I picked up, she paid me eighty. So I made two hundred already just from like stuff that I don't have on me. So we're gonna start at two hundred, three hundred, three fifty. 370, 390, 410, 430, 450, 470, 490. 
550, 551, 52, 53. So in total, I made 553. I was super, super busy this morning from the OU and Texas game, which, y'all, it was such a close game. It was such a freaking close game. I really thought Texas had it, but OU came in the last second and won the game. So congratulations to them, but it's still hooking for life. Okay, don't get it twisted. But yeah, it's one in the morning. I just got home, so I'm gonna go to bed, girl. Bye. I'll probably upload this tomorrow, so y'all probably seeing this, but yeah. But I love you guys so, so much. Like, so, so much. I swear I do. But I am finna go to bed. It is literally 1 in the morning. It is 1 in the morning. I just got home. Like, I just walked in my house, immediately propped up my camera and was like, yeah. I need to close out this video so I can go to bed. I did not expect to get home this late, which, I mean, we don't close until 12, so I knew the possibility was there, but I was really hoping and praying that I was gonna get cut early. Didn't happen. I still actually had one table, but I closed them out and they were just sitting there drinking, so another one of the girls helped me out and said she would clean up the table for me so I could go. So shout out her, literally, you the best. Yeah, y'all, I am so tired. I'm ready to go to bed. I'm ready to take my makeup off. I gotta be back up there at 10.30 tomorrow morning to do another shift and i work until tuesday and tomorrow's sunday so i still have sunday monday and tuesday all morning shifts to work before i get an off day and then i literally have one off day and i'm right back to work the next day so yeah y'all i'm grinding i love working there i really do but definitely a little stressed because i missed last week's upload miss friday's upload and i was gonna try to get it up today actually but i just am nowhere near ready to post it yet so as soon as i get some time tomorrow or or just whenever I get time and I feel capable of editing it, I will get it up for you guys. That video will already be, the one I'm talking about is the Juicy Confessions video, which is already up on my channel. If you guys want to go watch it, I'll put it in the iCard. But yeah, y'all, I'm about to go to bed. I love y'all so much. Hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed and turn post notifications on so that way you don't miss out on any of my other videos. Follow me on all of my other social media platforms. I'll have them linked in the description box down below. But yeah, I love you guys. Sweet dreams. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. Thank you.